Hello, Vinyl Community. Welcome to my channel. I'm Curtis Young here with Young LP Lovers, making my second video of the day, an unusual uh, event for me, but I've got the house to myself for a while, so why not? Uh, this is going to be another contest entry. Excuse me while I have some coffee. Um, this time for Dave the Pickup Artist. Uh, I'm going to be showing some psych. I just did a video on Prague. Uh, I'm going to do one on, one for, on psych now. Uh, Dave the Pickup Artist. Uh, if you haven't seen his channel, you got to check it out. Man, uh, what, what, a, what an interesting cast. Uh, really cool channel. Shows lots of psych stuff. Uh, again, I'm learning lots, uh, but this channel is really cool. It's uh, kind of reminds me of like uh, uh, like a William Burroughs kind of novel, or uh, uh, if uh, if Hunter S. Thompson had a had a YouTube channel dedicated to uh, to psych or something. That's it. We can't stop here. This is bad country. Delightful sometimes disturbing. <laughs> Very cool stuff. So uh, I've got a few albums here. He wants us to show five uh, psych albums. This is Push to 200. Uh, he's already surpassed that. I'm getting into the contest a little late. Uh, I think the deadline is it's coming up the 15th maybe or something. So if you want to get in, uh, now your, uh, time's running out. Uh, so he wants us to show five psych albums. I don't have any of that sort of super psychedelic melt your face kind of psych but I do have some psych. So uh, let's get into it. First, we have Mr. Hendrix, Jimmy himself. Uh, so uh, this is like a, a smash hit uh, uh, compilation. Uh, here with Purple Haze on it. Uh, Can you see me? All along the watchtowers here. Uh, so just classic uh, Hendrix tunes. Uh, with that psychedelic guitar playing, yeah. Uh, and kind of a psychedelic looking cover as well, yeah. Uh, so that's my first entry, Hendrix. Next up, we're gonna go with Santana. Yeah, Santana, absolutely love Santana. Uh, I could've went with probably any of his first few albums. Uh, but this uh, Abraxas, the second album is probably my probably my favorite Santana album. It stays in my heavy rotation bin because I put it on all the time. Uh, so there they are here. Uh, uh, Black Magic Woman, Oi Como Va. Uh, it's got, uh, I didn't realize that was uh, Tito Puente on there. Huh, cool. Uh, Samba Para uh, Pati. Uh, oh, anyway, lots of great uh, kind of psychedelic riffs. Uh, throughout this album, uh, Santana, Black, uh, uh, Abraxas, sorry, Abraxas. Next up, we got The Doors, and I hemmed and hawed which Doors album uh, to show. Um, uh, I, I've, only got, I've got three Doors albums, um, uh, the debut album, um, uh, Morrison Hotel and L.A. Woman. And so I hemmed and hawed which one way to go, but I think I decided to go with Morrison Hotel. Um, I think it's probably their least bluesy uh, and they're more sort of psychedelic tracks on here uh, than uh, some of their others. So Waiting for the Sun, I would say, is in that category. Uh, Ship of Fools uh, has that psychedelic. Lion Toe also. Um, Queen of the Highway has got the psychedelic elements. Certainly Indian Summer, the last one here, Maggie McGill. No, that one's more bluesy. Anyway, um, so... Uh, yeah, the Doors with some psych, uh, psychedelic rock. I just showed this album in my last video, but I'm going to show it again. <laughs> Sgt. Pepper. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, with, uh, let's see, what do you got here? You've got uh, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. Uh, uh, Within You, Without You. That, 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 that's psyched to me, man. Uh, so I, I, I showed a little blue. Uh, Beatles again. Now, I, so that's four. And I hemmed and hawed a bit my fifth one, so I'm actually going to show, well, three more. Uh, because they're all kind of borderline psych. Uh, I don't know, you tell me what you think. Uh, first one's compilation. <laughs> and I'm showing this just for one song. Yeah? Uh, Platoon, great, great soundtrack. Uh, 
But this has Jefferson Airplane's White Rabbit. Uh, when I think of it, it's like, that's what, I, that's what comes to mind for me. Yeah, so uh, Jefferson Airplane uh, via the soundtrack for the film Platoon. Uh, it also has uh, uh, The Doors on here, Hello, I Love You. Uh, what else? Anything else? Uh, no, it's got some soul. Otis Redding, some Aretha, uh, Smokey Robinson, Okie from the Skokie. Uh, it's a funny tune in the mix. All right, now the next one. Uh, actually, I got uh, the idea for this from another video I watched. Um, oh, I think it's called Whatever, what Everything? Whatever Thing? Whatever Thing is his channel. Uh, check him out. He's only got a few subscribers, but he's got great videos. Uh, um, whatever thing. Uh, he showed for his entry, Sly and the Family Stone, and I thought, for psych. And then, uh, uh, so as I was making my entry, I'm like, yeah, I've got some Sly and the Family Stone, I'm gonna listen to this. So, uh, sure enough, I checked on my Discogs, and it's labeled as uh, Psychedelic Funk. Uh, and yeah, you know, some of the songs, even like the common ones, like I Wanna Take You Higher, there's, there's some psychedelic elements on here. Uh, summertime. Uh, uh, hot fun in the summertime. There's psychedelic elements there, yeah? So they call it uh, psychedelic soul. Look at that. <laughs> Those guys are so cool. All right, so there is uh, some psychedelic soul. And the last one, we're going to go with some psychedelic jazz. Uh, so this is Sergio Mendes in the Brazil 77. And this is Primal Roots. Now, this is the Japanese press, and so it's got a different cover. Uh, but the back cover is the same. Um, and this is just a great album. Again, I've showed this one before in my, uh, I think in my vinyl tag, for favorite jazz albums, this is like Bossa Nova, sort of, Sergio Mendes mainly does like Bossa Nova kind of stuff. But this one, Primal Roots, is heavily percussion based. Uh, and particularly the B side of this uh, album, it's basically one track, uh, 18 minutes long. Uh, that gets psychedelic, man. There's like some uh, harmonica playing in there that's kind of trippy, and the, the piano. Uh, and even side one, I can't remember which track it was, uh, but again, I was listening to this the other night, and I was thinking, yep, this counts. I'm gonna count it. This is this, the psychedelic jazz. Uh, not quite avant-garde uh, on side B, but definitely, uh, definitely psychedelic. So there you have it. There are my five plus uh, entries for Dave the Pickup Artist. Uh, I'll put his link down below. Uh, check out his channel uh, uh, and enjoy. I'm sure you'll uh, have fun with that. Cheers.